Hey guys, welcome back to the Snapper and Chronicles. We're coming back at you with another tool video. Uh, this time it's something from our favorite store, or one of our favorite stores. I haven't really uh, had a tool from there for for, for kind of a while. Uh, but this time uh, I picked up this uh, socket set. And I usually don't pick up new sockets, but... I'll get it. I'll get into that in a second. If uh, you guys find these videos at all helpful, entertaining, uh, before anything, could you give me a like and also subscribe to this channel? Uh, I would appreciate it. And okay, so yeah, like I said, I don't usually nowadays buy uh, any new sockets. Um, it seems like I have a ton of uh, older sockets uh, that I've picked up throughout the years uh second hand and they're pretty they're usually usa ones and they're pretty good quality so i don't bother uh buying any new um uh, any new sockets but uh the sockets that i can't find uh used or whatever are usually uh, these kind of sockets um they call it it says star point but these are torque sockets and usually when I find sockets used, they'll be just regular sockets. There won't be any uh, any hex ones or any Torx ones. So I didn't have any, so I figured I'd buy this small set. And this was on sale uh, a couple of weeks ago, I think. They had the coupons, and the coupon, this is usually... $9.99, $10 for this set, and they had a coupon for $6, so I said, hey, why not, uh, I'll pick it up, and here is the set, you got nine of them, and five of them are a quarter inch drive, and you get these four over here, the bigger ones are three eighths drives, and I took them all out, and they're kind of a pain to get out, uh, just so I won't waste no time. So they're all pre-plucked, uh, you can say. And to get them out, the quickest way that I found to get these out is you just pull them and then just uh, rotate them around. Just as you're pulling, you rotate them. And they should come out. They're still a pain to get out, but that's how I was able to get them out with a lot of without a lot of hassle. But you know, I guess they don't want these to fall off the package while they're uh, in the store, so they have to get them on there pretty good. Okay, this is item number six seven nine one four. And as I said, they call this the Star Point Socket Set. And it comes with the quarter inch drive T10, T15, T20, T25, and a T27, which is kind of a weird number. And the 3 eighths uh, drive ones is the T30, T40, T45, and T50. High visibility markings, which you can see in a second it's pretty cool and these are made in Taiwan so they are made in Taiwan not China so uh, probably a little bit better quality than you would get from a set of Chinese uh, Torx sockets but uh, the engraving part uh, yeah, I kind of like this engraving, actually. It's pretty deep. It isn't that laser etching, which I really don't like, which seems to be every tool nowadays is like laser etched, which I get it. It saves a few pennies to laser etch instead of having a good engraving, but still, I kind of uh, still yearn for those days where things were done properly and... Mm, there wasn't always a race to the bottom for every little thing but these have a nice deep engraving on them 
which is cool and this is the T50 and it's they make it a pretty decent size the number the T50 part and S2 CRV and not sure what S2 stands for uh, CR-V chrome vanadium and uh, the broaching seems pretty good everything looks clean they have the dimples in them on the side for uh, your drive tool to latch on to and these are hex so they do have a hex opening I don't know if you can make it out there because it's kind of dark but they are hex opening I don't know how they if they're press fit in there or what the deal is uh, they seem pretty secure but then again I'm only pulling them with my fingers but uh, they seem not too bad taking a look inside uh, you probably I'm trying to blind you guys uh, yeah it's too shiny <laughs> for the light but it doesn't seem too bad I think they are press fit because I don't see any um, sort of epoxy or anything on the female side the back of uh, of the drives here I don't see any epoxy or anything like that but uh, one thing that I thought was pretty good also is on the quarter inch ones the quarter inch drives that they also have the dimples uh, for uh, the quarter inch drive to uh, the ball detent to latch on to and a lot of cheaper uh, quarter inches you don't find uh, dimples in them so that was another cool feature and here's the back also of the drive and I don't see any adhesive or anything so I think they are kind of press fit in there don't know as far as the drives I don't know if they're high quality or what I just got them they're brand new you guys who have tested these and bought these and used them let me know in the comments if actually they're any good uh, I would assume at this price point they're nine pieces for like ten dollars they're about a dollar a little bit more than a dollar each I would assume that uh, these aren't pro grade uh, sockets they're probably just uh, you know weekend warrior or just uh, home home use uh, kind of uh, Torx sockets maybe uh, you use them once in a blue moon you know something you wouldn't probably use every day or as a pro but uh, as far as I can see the fit and finish is pretty nice on these uh, I don't see uh, any bad broaching or any anything that sticks out as being bad with these as far as the material like I said don't know don't know how the quality of the material is but on the face of everything they do seem okay and you can see the deep engraving there and this is the T45 and on the smaller ones also engraved and you can see the number there it's a little bit smaller but still pretty big for the size of socket that it is and this is the T25 so all in all seems okay uh, yeah just on the face of it yeah it seems like a good buy to pick up if you can get a coupon for this even better but um you know like i said uh maybe not the best choice if you're a pro good for probably you know fixing stuff once in a while you might need a torx and you might need uh the leverage of a 3 eighths on the torx so 
it's good to have them for something like that. But if you're gonna use if you're gonna use them every day, eh, I don't know if I if I would vouch for this set. But anyhow, that's all I got for now. All right, guys. Until next time.